Welcome back to Misery 2. So, uh, here we go. Once again, forgetting to, uh, go into wireless with the mouse. So, a little bit of a pause there. Seems to be a little less choppy than uh, before. Not by much. Um, I forced my recording program, DX Story, to, uh, go back to the default of allowing it to use the GPU for rendering. Maybe that'll speed some things up. Because a lot of scripts in the X-Ray engine are very CPU intensive rather than uh, GPU intensive. <clears throat> I don't know. First, I kind of want to take a look at this stash. Because unless I misread some comments on uh, previous videos, what you need to do is... Or there's supposedly a way to climb onto the pipe near where the stash is and uh, get the goodies there. Here's my current loadout for uh, today's uh, mucking about. I had to take a drink there, so uh, covered everything up, of course. I'm um, sure. Let's have some bread. That'll push us up to where we need to be for satiety. There we go. Nothing terribly amazing, and I probably should have kept the, uh, shotgun in my inventory, because I'm seeing mutants around. But I think this will, I think this will do nicely. Get to play around with this, uh, nice new revolver. In shitty condition. Got this for backup. And a jet flew around somewhere. I'm not quite certain how you're supposed to get onto the pipe near where the stash is. I'm pretty sure this is one they were referring to when uh, mention was made to me about uh, you know, getting this stash. Let's see, for it to work, you would have to get on up this way. Because this is the... Aha! That might be it right there. Maybe if I add something to, uh... Oh, wait. Maybe I can jump from this hill. Aha! Wow. Thanks for the suggestion. Uh, people who suggested this, whose name is, names I don't remember. I have never actually tried this before. I always went for the, uh... Well, I suppose you could call it the Occam's Razor Path. Just shoot this shit down and hope that you get it all. So what is it? It's uh, sparkling water and a metal bottle of crappy alcohol. Zone produced vodka. Well, I can't really say it's much worse than what was there in vanilla. If I remember right, that was uh, uh, bandages, sausage, crap like that. <clears throat> Now, what's the plan? What's the plan? Uh, not getting stuck moving forward and not, when I'm not pressing any buttons. that That's a good place. <laughs> good plan to start with. I'm going to skip this part of the Bloodsucker quest because I already know where it is. Down this way. You know, and... Uh, yeah, I know where it is. It costs 2,000 rubles to get Al to cough up the... Info, and I don't feel like paying that. Please stop with your friggin... Crap game. Stuttering, that's the term I'm trying to think of. I really hope I'm not using fancy <laughs> AP ammo. I should double check. Hollow point. Incendiary. Well, yeah, I'd say these are a bit more... Worthwhile to use against mutants than the incendiary. There I go again, holding down the aim key because I'm used to uh, Shadow of Chernobyl still, even though I haven't actually played that in a while. The only reason I'm trying to, you know, finish off these boars is, you know, I've already started shooting at them because they came after me, and there's no sense in wasting those bullets and not getting anything back. 
Good God, enough of the stutter already. Jesus Christ. Beautiful. <laughs> I love it when I can somehow actually manage to land shots like that. It's amazing. You know, I just have zero confidence in my ability to uh, aim without a crosshair or iron sights, and uh, as my previous performances have shown, there's good reason for that. Now let's, yeah, let's stop by this good off, sell off this crap real quickly. And uh, based on what I've seen in the mod DB uh, discussion thread surrounding this mod, um. I need to get an artifact application container, or whatever that device is, because it basically takes the place of <clears throat> the jellyfish and the vanilla and similar artifacts, you know, radiation, uh, dissipation, and if I get that, it's pretty much smooth sailing. I can even eat the crappy standard uncooked mutant food. Because it'll just get rid of all the radiation. Border belt. Bunch of crap that is. I've actually almost got enough to pay off uh, Owl up there. But whatever, I don't really feel like going with that. What the hell's up with my mouse? Seriously, this is the second time it's done this crap. The first time being when I was uh, doing Shadow Chernobyl. AAC, 7249. Radiation minus one. Ah! Huh. It's the same radiation... Uh, avoidance. Crap, I need another slot. Let's just see how much that costs. I want to know how much money I'm going to have to... Uh, Invest in this upgrade. Hey, Garden. Oh, uh, assuming there's another. Great. Great. Yeah, I know he needs vodka and the tools for this crap, but I just want to... Calibration tools. Okay, fuck that. I'm gonna... A, the AAC is gonna have to wait until I get a better suit, because frankly, I don't feel like getting calibration tools in prep yet to upgrade this piece of shit. It's just a leather coat. Anyway, forward, onward, and whatchamacallit, etc. Down to this place to hopefully not get brutally murdered by uh, our anomalies while I pick up the poisonous gas. I, yeah, I think that's actually why I left the shotgun at home. In the base. To free up the uh, space for it. And let's see. What about other possibilities? Well, I want to go down to the uh, Iron Forest Anomaly area. Because I've heard that's where some tools are stored. And obviously, tools are kind of necessary. I probably should have organized my desk a little better before starting this. And my friggin' cold drink that's going to have condensation off the uh, improvised uh, drink coaster thing. And the one drink that's been sitting here for hours has been on it. Ridiculous. Let's just double check these don't use the UB UPD power. Good. It's got its own batteries, I guess. What is with that hunger icon? Seriously. Should be nowhere near hungry enough to actually need to use anything. So, honestly, it should just get out of the way. I'll just slide along the uh, Bethesda Hills as I try to get past the ranger station. I have no idea how well <clears throat> how well this is going to go. I mean, it isn't exactly hard uh, in vanilla, but considering uh, what misery does, I wouldn't be surprised if this was 
suddenly transformed into some ridiculously difficult task. While I'm in the area, maybe I'll uh, hit up the old sewage treatment plant, shoot some mercs, try to get some uh, money from their loot. It'll, take <clears throat> It'll, of course, take me 20 hours to uh, get anything accomplished carrying that much stuff, but... Yeah, what can you do? Money's money. But damn, yeah. That AAC seems like such a useful thing, but I really don't want to get rid of my bullet resistance for it. Here's the moment of truth. Yep, the saving is no faster when offloading the recording to the GPU. No idea what's up with that. It seems to do that when I'm not even recording as well. Okay, where exactly... I don't remember where exactly you can get on top of the, uh... Pipeline. <coughs> pipeline. Guess the ladder is... Or access ladder is a bit further ahead. Almost ran directly into that. That would have been, uh... Amazing. Come on, how are you tired already, man? Have you already used up friggin'... What? Two bars of... Food? Oh, come on, seriously? That pulled me into it when I was... Past it, beyond it. I didn't think I... Uh, strange, I didn't think my health fell far enough for the, uh... You know, near-death breathing to start up. Just pop an army medkit and hope that... Uh, takes care of the problem well enough. Okay, so I've got these keys. And that's all I've got. Huh. Ah, that's right, it was the sniper playthrough. The sniper class was, that I abandoned. That's, that's when I got the one down below. That's right. Completely forgot about that. Well, I suppose the saves are a little bit faster. Just a little bit. Not much. I should probably put this on. It has a slight radiation protection. Sort of thing. Though oddly, I'm not... radiation poisoned at all. How peculiar. Let me just check something here. For a second, it seemed like the overlay on this was causing a lot of, uh... frame drops. Didn't quite make any sense. Eh, it looks like it's just the, uh, usual. Would you please jump, man? You still need the other stuff. Well, so much for the sun. Can't have much of that in misery. Ooh, ammunition. That's pretty useful. I'd prefer it if the AKs were still here. I mean, you don't really have to make all the weapon drops or weapon stashes disappear. You could just, you know, make them not be perfect condition weapons in the stashes. That I think that would be good enough. Let's disagree with design decisions. That'll be a great series. Hey, mercenaries around here, stay calm. I'm just getting keys. I'll leave you alone. If you leave me alone. Just kidding, I'll probably go and murder you all horribly very soon. It's a nice and careful walk down here. One wonder is what the hell happened to this car when it fell down. Did it catch on fire? There we go, thank you. Oh yeah, I, I guess I can see something that somewhat resembles... No, I can't. No. No scorch marks. So did it catch on fire? Did somebody decide... Hmm, a car. It's at the bottom of the collapsed portion of the bridge. 
I wonder if I could get money from taking these doors and tires and selling them to some poor sap who thinks they're useful in the zone. I mean, if there were vehicle, drivable vehicles in the zone and that hadn't been cut out in Shadow of Chernobyl and just left cut, it'd make a bit more sense. Just in general, without scorch marks to indicate that it caught on fire, it doesn't make a whole lot of sense to see that vehicle uh, wheelless and in such a destroyed state. Well, no, not destroyed state. It makes perfect sense for it to be, be destroyed. It fell down a goddamn bridge. How about, uh, you know, wheelless and doorless with no doors laying around. It doesn't make a whole lot of sense. One of the many mysteries of the zone, I suppose. Oh, sweet. I'm not even over-encumbered. Of course, the stamina is still going to fall ridiculously quickly, but... Come on. Come on. You were saving relatively decently before. Got to slow down this much now. Now, the downside of this plan is... Yeah, I've currently got all my... Uh armor-piercing rounds equipped in this rifle right now. So, after 19 shots, I'm gonna have to try to kill people with, uh... FMJ rounds, and that honestly has not seemed to have been a very successful endeavor before. Probably didn't even even need to save right there, but whatever. It's misery. Save every 20 seconds if you have to. Ooh, sparkling water. I don't know. It's actually worse than regular water for radiation. Okay, let's put the incendiary stuff in this. Believe it or not, I think they actually did a better job with the Reloading animation for this modded pistol than uh, Valve did for Half-Life 2. The uh, second game. Okay, so... Yeah, I think I'll try to start the assault from this way. I'm just gonna say, it, it definitely looks kind of strange looking off in this distance and seeing all these uh, textures so obviously repeating. Not used to seeing that in Stalker. Okay. I've got a bunch of grenades. Is that a merc in a trench coat? How absurd. I think I got him. I hope I got him. Really do. Yeah, it looks like it. Sweet. They have no idea what happened. It's crazy. Oh, I didn't even notice I was crouching there. I was wondering why I was going so slowly. How many mercs are here, by the way? I think that's information that probably would have been nice to figure out before uh, starting the assault. Actually, let's double check here with the 9mm ammo. Highest piercing class 1. Yeah, so it's the same. So either way, it's ineffective against body armor, which most of these mercs probably have. Well, I guess I just hope I won't have to start using that pistol. Eh, okay, come on. Surprised the mercs haven't said a thing to me. Whoa, whoa. almost ran right into that guy. Yep, at first it didn't look like they... Yeah, at first the first dude to come out looked like he was just walking along. Yeah, you know, doing his whole patrol thing. Ooh, that was a nice throw. 
Okay, let's uh, let's pop this in back. These guys are ridiculously good shots. I hate to waste all my grenades like this. Shit. Wow, okay. Okay. 